It's Pride History Month on the Claremont High School campus, but if the recent death of transgender student Chloe Vivian Kreutzer isn't difficult enough, it's how the situation is being handled by school administration that's upsetting many of her friends. They say Chloe died last week because of an accidental prescription drug overdose. But when the school district put out this email about the student's death, the principal used the name she was born with and referred to her as he, something known in the transgender community as dead naming. It's very hurtful because dead naming, it's like, you were that person before and you're changing into a new person. You're evolving in a way. And it's hurtful when you get called that name because it's bringing you back to how you were and who you no longer are. Alexa McMillan was one of Chloe's best friends. Although Chloe's mom didn't want to go on camera, she told us that Chloe started using that name more than a year ago and she and Chloe even spoke with campus administration about a name change going forward. But we also spoke with the father who told us, quote, we're all mourning this person. We all love this person. We're only using his legal name. It's the only name we knew. In a statement, the school district declined to address the issue of why Chloe's born name was used, saying, quote, I realize that some students, parents, or community members have concerns regarding the statement that Claremont High School put out regarding this loss. When tragic events happen to our students, the district only puts out a statement reflecting the family's wishes and only does so with the consent of a family representative. Monica McMillan is Alexa's mother. They have Claremont Pride shirts. Wolfpack Pride shirts, but where was the pride for Chloe? Where's the pride for all the transgender teens here at the school? It's, it's, it's outrageous and it's upsetting. In Claremont, Rob McMillan, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV and Roku to watch on your TV.